to get it all never slip through my fingers hey everyone welcome back on the channel welcome back to another episode 3 video today we are back with uh, ukong benchmark tool so for those who don't know that uh, ukong benchmark tool is uh, now free to download on steam like uh, you can download this copy of this benchmark tool on uh, steam you can just search it here ukong and you will see this black myth ukong benchmark tool it is free to download uh, this is a good move from the developer like uh, you can get a overview of the performance about the game the visuals and then you can decide if you want to buy it or not so yeah it's beneficial for both like for the de developers and for the customers also so yeah this uh, game and the benchmark tool already have fsa 3 but uh, the limitation is you can only use the frame generation uh, with the fsr upscaler so when you are using the dlss subscaler you won't be able to use this uh, frame generation so yeah today we're going to decouple that uh, frame generation and uh, upscaler so yeah let's begin this video without any delay so first of all you will see two zips here uh okong benchmark fsr 3 for md and gtx and okong benchmark fsr 3 for rtx so i'm going to show it for the md and gtx and rtx users i'll just uh, show the zip and tell the method right now so you can see here some files you just need to paste these files and then enable driver signature and run the game but for amd and gtx it is little bit different so yeah let's follow me so we're going to extract this uh, zip at the desktop amd gtx zip now after extracting we're going to open this folder right here and we're gonna go to the installation directory of uh, this benchmark tool which is by default will be in c if you have not changed program files x86 then steam steam apps common black myth wukong benchmark tool after that we're gonna go inside b1 binaries and win64 now in here uh, first uh, we will paste uh, these files and if you can't see the dlss in game then you will need to paste this in vgx.dll also so yeah but first we're going to paste these files only because uh, we can see the dlss after pasting this but if you can't see the dlss uh, you will need to paste this in bgx.dll also so yeah after that uh, we're going to run the launcher and then close the cmd window when it pops up now we will see exact fz3 config has appeared here now we're going to open it with uh, notepad now in here we will just uh, make this fake nvidia gpu to true and fake nv api to true then we're going to save the file and now we're going to jump back inside the game and uh, i will show uh, some things and talk about a few things also wukong pre-booking is still available for only 2.99 indian rupees the stock is limited so hurry up all right uh, i'm inside this benchmark tool now so i'm gonna go to the setting display uh, you can see i'm running on 1080p with uh, borderless as this game does not have any full screen mode uh, b sync frame rate cap off motion blur is set to big because i don't like it and if you look here uh, every setting is set on high except the anti-aliasing because i will be using the dlss uh, one more thing i have swapped the gtx mod with the uh, rtx mod uh, while loading up the game because i want to talk about a few things so now if you come back here uh, you will see that uh, now frame generation is selectable with dlss previously the frame generation is only selectable with this fsr only so yeah now you can select it with the dlss also i'm going to be use this uh, resolution slider on 67 percent which is uh, equivalent to the dlss quality option you can see here mode quality and yeah now i'm gonna start the benchmark and uh, talk and show a few things uh, which is interesting so yeah do hold on all right the game's benchmark has started uh, this game does look beautiful like i have not turned on the ray tracing yet the game is 
looking beautiful uh, you can see the current fps value of the engine here and this is the msi afterburner overlay so uh, for which user this mod will be useful uh, if i talk honestly the rtx users will be the main user who will benefit from this mod like previously you will need to use the fsr upscaler uh, only with the frame generation so now you can use the dlss uh, upscaler along with the fsr 3 frame generation because it have been now decoupled you can see all the texture here all the uh, details they are being now rendered with the dlss because i have swapped the mod in between don't worry md and gtx mod will also work fine but yeah uh, they the md and gtx users will not get maybe any real uh, real world benefit but uh, you know uh, it's just a peace of mind and some users do like to experiment so i have made the mod uh, you can also check the input latency with the fsr 3 and um, dlss uh, like the fsr uh, upscaler and dlss upscaler with the gtx mod also uh, so yeah uh, one more thing the wukong pre-booking is still uh, available the slots are getting filled up really quick so if you have not booked your copy uh, book uh, quickly just come to discord and dm me or just uh, text in the particular uh, channel so yeah uh, this will be it for this video now if this video does help you uh, you can subscribe to the channel comment down below if you're facing any kind of issue while using this mod and yeah i'll see you guys in the next one until then cheers now i'll just wait for this benchmark to complete and then i'll end the video